everybody, I'm Steven here with Tiny House Listings, and today I'm in front of a 16-foot lab. Uh, this is the ultra-budget model that we build, and we've got some exciting news from here until the end of the year. We're running a special where you can get these and with the prices down from $35,000 to $29,500. So we're trying to figure out a way to get the cost of these down permanently, but for now, that's the price. Um, this is a fully functional tiny house. It's mostly meant for single occupancy in a pinch. Two people could live in it. Uh, but anyways, I want to take you around real quick. So we'll just kind of walk around real quick. Uh, the entire house is clad in LP sheet siding. This is a 50 year product. It's painted to whatever color you want. We use Sherman William paint, Sherman Williams paint, and uh, you just pick which color you want. We paint it. And um, if you come across the front, we got a 32 inch door, entry door, um, water spigot. So if you have a garden outside and you want to uh, water your flowers, whatever, that's a good way to go. Um, <clears throat> each corner has stabilizer jacks. Those are really good to level this thing off. And when you get it parked where you want, you can bring those down. We have dual 6,000 pound heavy duty axles. Uh, we estimate this one to only weigh about 6,000 pounds. So you're well, well below um, the weight with this right here. Exterior also has a GFI outlet. So if you need to plug anything in, weed eater whatever it happens to be outside you're welcome to do that on the back here on the back here we can uh, have a permanently mounted mini split now the price that i included earlier does not include that that is an upcharge so but if you wanted to buy it really cheap at twenty nine thousand five hundred, you could put a window unit in that heats and cools um for before a small upcharge you can have a mini split install which i highly recommend um, these have tail lights, just like any regular uh, tiny house would. If you go in the back, I'll show you the, the business end. <laughs> so the tiny house underneath hooks up just like a regular RV. There's a water hose spigot under here. And there is also um, a 50 amp plug-in, that you can see there, right here. So any standard 50 amp plug-in will go in right there. And then also all of your black water and gray water. That means when you flush your toilet, when you use the kitchen sink, uh, when you take a shower, all of that comes out of this three inch PVC pipe. So if you have sewer at your house, if you have septic, or even if you have a holding tank, believe it or not, there's some people let all this stuff spill in a ditch, but I would not recommend that with black water. That's pretty gross. Uh, <clears throat> all, everything comes out of here. So you hook up with a PVC pipe or a flexible hose, depending on what your situation is, and you just run it straight down into uh, wherever it happens to go. We also have two back windows on the back right here. So this house has a total of four windows. All right, so now we'll step inside and we'll give you a quick tour, show what it looks like on the inside. All right, so now we're inside. This is a 16 foot uh, tiny house. The walls look like they're made of drywall, but we actually use premium cabinet grade plywood on these walls. So that adds a lot more strength and durability and it just looks a lot nicer. And, um, but the way this is set up, this is the living area. So basically you can kind of divide the house into two sections. Eight foot goes back that way towards the bathroom and the kitchen and then eight foot this way, uh, roughly. Um, but the way you see we have it set up here is we have a day bed, which could also serve as your, uh, your couch and also your bed. Now there's lots of options. You could do a Murphy bed in here. You could do what's called a trundle bed, which I really like. It's a bed up, up top and then it's a slide out. It's a couch up top and then you slide the, be the bed out underneath. That way you kind of have two separate couch sitting areas and a sleeping area. A lot of different ways you can do it. You can even take this twin size bed and run it this way, right? And then, then that way you have a desk on this area. You could put a sitting table, an eating table, a work area, a longer chair. You could put a second couch or another bed there if you wanted. So you kind of have two twin beds, lots of configurations. Um, if you wanted, you could put more storage shelves up here. Yeah, mini splits back up here up top. You can see that. Again, this one is rated for 450 square feet. This house is only 16 by eight, a fraction of that. So heating and cooling is zero problem. Um, another option you could do right here, if you wanted, is put a floor to ceiling storage option here to put your clothes in. Um, for an additional charge, we can even uh, build you one of those if you want. Um, if you look up at the ceiling really quick, you'll notice that we use the same cabinet grade plywood but we nickel gap it, so it's a really nice look. We like that, we've had some really good feedback on that. So heading over to the kitchen area, this kitchen is uh, a little over four and a half feet long, and uh, we have storage shelves, as you can see here. We have a nice wall mounted cabinet. 
Uh, we have a 36 inch cabinet here, small uh, dorm style fridge, got a freezer in it as well. Got your small kitchen, a two burner induction cooktop. So this kitchen is fully functional. Your water heater's underneath here, which is an eight gallon water heater. Um, here in the bathroom, if you wanna go in there, Gabe, check it out. We have a standard flush toilet. Also have a 32 inch stand up shower, which is very nice. And if you look above, you'll notice all of our tiny houses have a, van, uh, a fan. And we also have what's called a humidistat. So whenever the humidity reaches a certain level, it kicks on. Also have a light in there. We also have recessed lighting above in here. So as you can see, this is a fully functional home. The whole thing's painted for you inside and out. It's made of traditional building supplies, nothing experimental. And for what this is, we know as a fact, we've looked at everything. This is the best deal for $29,500. It's fully certified. You can finance this house if you want, or you can pay cash. Uh, but we know the market very well. This is going to be the best tiny house that you could possibly purchase for the price. So anyways, if you have any questions, email us at build at tinyhouselistings.com or you can go to tinyhouselistings.build and we'll also have a link to uh, a listing uh, in the description below. So thanks for watching. See you on the next video.